Hello my friends, visitors and subscribers. My name is Tildrell and it's time to finally pick the giveaway winners. As you can see, I'm on commentpicker.com. I've entered the URL, I checked the important boxes and I've gotten all the comments with the required hashtag in them. Now, the only thing we need to do is to pick the 10 winners and I'm very excited for that. So, without further ado, let's go. The first winner is... Calm. It's a very cute, calm cat. And he congratulated me on 1k subs. Thank you, Calm. I will contact you in the comment section of my YouTube video. You will notice it. I have no doubt. Of course, you are one winner for the Welkin Moon Pass. Yeah, I should have said that before. I will pull the five winners of the Welkin uh, at first, and then I will pull the five winners of the Welkin and the Battle Pass together. Let's see who our second winner will be. It is... Alexa M. Okay, congratulations Alexa, you just won a Welkin Moon Pass, fresh out of the oven. Number three of our Welkin winners is... <laughs> who is it? J Cool. And he uh, congratulates me on my 1k milestone as well and he hopes for more Genshin content soon. Yeah, I hope I can fulfill your wishes, dude. I really try my best to, yeah, produce Genshin content and some uh, alternative content as well for my channel. Thank you for participating. The fourth winner is... A fine specimen with the name Pokemon Master Freeman, okay, Pokemon Master Freeman. Uh, I should do build guides for beginners. Okay, uh, maybe I can re-record something of my beginner guides I did in the yeah early times of my channel. But if you take a look at my earlier Genshin videos, you will see that I made full artifact guides, full game mechanic guides, and pretty much everything newer players. Uh, want to know. Okay, so just check out my older videos and maybe I will re-record some of them with time because yeah, my general speaking style and video style has gotten better. Of course, <laughs> if you compare my nowadays videos with videos I did like, yeah, one year ago. And the last winner for our Welkin Moon Passes is... It's Leonardo Augusto <laughs> and he congratulates me as well and he oh he got to tell after watching my foolproof ritual <laughs> okay my pleasure to help you dude uh, good job on pulling your own hotel I bet she will help you in the abyss tremendously but now my friends we are coming to the bigger prizes to the deluxe packages let's say who will win the Welkin Moon and the Battle Pass in one neat sweep. Let's see, the first winner is... Shash Hank... Shash Hank Dixit? Okay, <laughs> Shash Hank Dixit, congratulations! You just won a Welkin Moon and a Battle Pass hand in hand. The second winner of our deluxe prize is... Noah! Winner number three is Uwu Kun. Okay, <laughs> Uwu Kun, who just wants me to fly high to the sky. I try, but now it would be so nice if the last two winners were long-term subscribers. I'm rooting for you guys. Okay, you really deserve it. Okay, that's cool. Michael Rivas Rivera is here for a longer time. I have remembered that name because it's quite cool sounding. Okay, so congratulations, Michael. And now to the last winner. Please let it be someone like Cars Lucky K or someone else who is here for a long time and is a cool dude, cool person. Oh, yeah! It's Sync! Congratulations, dude! Finally someone who is here from the very, from the really very 
beginning. I'm so happy that I can pay back your loyalty in some kind of way, okay? And yeah, he likes the tradition of cracking a cold one, my uh, whiskey drinking videos that I spread here and there in between my uploads. <laughs> Very cool, man. I'm so happy for you. Welcome, guys. We are on Pokemon Master's account right now. And in Genshin Impact, he calls himself Harry. He's on adventure rank 45, so <laughs> I'm glad to help a uh, yeah, newer player or a uh, player in the mid game, let's say he's in the mid game, to yeah help his account progression at least a little bit with the Welcome Moon Pass, which I will unlock right now. Here you go, buddy. Welcome Moon unlocked and as you can see harry is trying to rock a pyro main dps team with hu tao as main dps of course with shanglinga support beidou as an additional damage support and um overload reaction enabler yep and gene as animal healer that's a very interesting team if i might say so gene with uh, let's see here okay noblesse oblige and gladiators interesting choice your team would be much stronger if you would at least equip gene with the viridescent venera four piece set okay if you don't know where this is <laughs> just go to this domain here and farm this set okay then your rotation would be you um, pull out shangling's teddy bear goba you apply pyro you then uh, do some animal skill with Gene to decrease the resistances of your enemies. And once you've done that, your Hu Tao will do even more damage than she's doing now. Okay, buddy, <laughs> just equip Gene with Veritas and Venera and your life should be, yeah, even easier than it is now. We are on Alex M's account, on Alexandra's account, and we've unlocked the Welcome Moon Pass already. As you can see here, it's up and running. She's a veteran player, adventure rank 51. And yeah, let's take a look at her team. Very nice. What do you have? Skyward Blade on level 70. Hey, you're over adventure rank 50. You have no excuse to not level your main DPS's weapon to level 90, okay? Just level it up. It's a pretty uh, cool and safe weapon choice. I think every Skyward weapon is pretty good, except the Claymore version. I don't know why Mihoyo uh, made the Claymore so much worse than every other Skyward weapon, yeah? I have no clue. Level 90, very good and... Blitz Strand Gladiators. Um, good groundwork. But since you're using Barbara, why don't you build Ayako with a four piece Blitz Strayer set? So you get all this crit chance for free. You're getting like 40% crit chance just when you attack a frozen enemy. And together with Barbara, you can permafreeze your enemies. Just just build a four-piece Blizzard Strayer set, okay? So with um, this broken extra 40% crit chance, you can solely or almost solely um, concentrate on crit damage and your Ayaka's damage will skyrocket, okay? Just do that. I don't quite see the use of a Geo Traveler here. And wait a second, you have... You have Kokomi and you don't... you. Level up Kokomi, please level up Kokomi and use her instead of Barbara. I'm no fan of Kokomi myself, but when you have her, she does everything Barbara is doing, but better. And when you're building her up, just go to the Ridge Watch right here and farm some HP pieces on this set, on the Millilith set, because her jellyfish is up pretty much all the time. So you have a constant uptime of this 20% attack increase for your whole team. Please just level up your Kokumi, ma'am. Level up your Kokumi. When you have when you have her, use her. And okay, you you have Sucrose, then I propose to, to you that you switch out your Geo Traveler for Sucrose because a Geo user in your elemental damage team makes no sense. Okay? 
And here we are on Michael Rivers Rivera's account. And it seems that I pulled very many Kokomi users in the batch of the uh, giveaway winners that responded to me. Um, account name Haru and wow, Adventuring57. Like on par with my ac account progression. Wow, congratulations, dude. Before we take a look at the main team, let me just unlock the Welkin Moon and the Battle Pass for this winner because Michael got himself the deluxe package. <laughs> After unlocking everything now, I'm really stoked to look into his teams because I'm always curious about niche builds and niche team comps that not everyone knows about or uses. Level 70? Level 7. Okay, he's 80? 70? But am I... Was I wrong? But you... You are adventure rank 57? Why aren't all your characters at level 90? What are you doing? Let's see. What your other characters are doing? 77. Who is your... You have... Okay. Now I see where your problem is. You're spreading too much, dude. Are you... This dude is having every single character on his account on level 70. Wow. Props for your commitment, dude. For real. I I couldn't do that. I I wouldn't dare to use my resources in that way. You've spread too wide. Oh my god. Now we are on Leonardo's account. And he is Adventure Rank. Also a veteran player. Wow. Adventure Rank 56. Okay. What makes me glad is that he is also a Yoimiya user. <laughs> that is always a nice thing to see. Let's just get it over with and unlock the Welkin Moon Pass for this lucky winner of this giveaway. Isn't that nice to have an active Welkin Moon Pass on your account? I think it is. It very much is. And now let's take a look at the characters while we are here. I see a Yoimiya almost fireworks team, but only almost. It just... I don't quite understand why you are using two healers. We have a bandit with sacrificial great sword. Hmm. You have that one. I mean, if you have an unused five star weapon, just use Skyward Blade on him, please. It has ev it even has more base attack. And as we all know, bandit's attack buff takes his base attack and base attack equals the weapon attack plus the character's own attack value and nothing else so hey use the skyward um pride nah, use the skyward blade dude please and it's it's tenacity of the millilith and gladiators finale aren't you using him as Buffer and healer? What are you using him for? I mean, you, you have this. You don't really need any of those things. You just need Constellation 1, but okay. And you leveled up his E as well. I, are you using him as a sub DPS and not that much as healer? Let me take a look. Okay, you play him with attack and crit. That's new. I never saw him used in that way. Hmm, interesting. But those those two pieces are really not good. Wow, oh my God. I pity you for your bad luck. But dude, just, just try to play him with a four piece Noblesse Oblige set, okay? doesn't even matter if you want to use him as main DPS, you, you can uh, go for um, offensive pieces of Noblesse Oblige, but just use him with no Noblesse, please. I tell you what, try this team either with Diona or Bennett as healer, preferably Bennett for the Pyro Resonance, and instead of Diona, you play Fischl with uh, Tenacity of the Millilith set. I mean, you haven't built her up 
now, but build uh, an offensive tenacity of the Millilith set, like you would build her as sub DPS, just with this set right here. Because like that, Fischl's Us keeps up this buff all the time, and if you have um, Noblesse Oblige on Bennett, you have a constant 40% attack bonus for your whole team and for your EMEA, okay? Welcome on Sync Genshin Impact Account, or how he calls himself in the game, Condensate, Adventure Rank 56. It seems like every winner that got chosen by this comment picker website is either mid game or late game. Let's see if that changes when I'm going to the other winners. Sync is one of the longtime subscribers of this channel, and so it pains me to see that I can't even buy him the Battle Pass because he bought it already for himself. Uh, because, yeah, he actually is up for the Supreme Package with Battle Pass plus Welkin. So what I will do is... I think I will just buy him the Welkin Moon Pass two times and then I will gift him a crystal top off for five euros worth. So at least I can give him the money's worth of a Welkin Moon and the Battle Pass, although I'm not buying the actual stuff. Okay, so when we take a look at the team Sync is using now, he rocks a child vaporized comp. Yeah, a child vaporized comp and as it seems, he is quite the optimizer. Am I right? Oh yeah, oh yeah, look at that child, even with a very decent hunt. So, battle pass weapons are put to good use on his account. What do we, oh, that's sad, no, five star bow. Man, imagine what you could do with a Skyward Harp or some other five star weapon, but hey, the very Descent Hunt is good as well because it uh, applies a small amount of CC to the enemies and it gathers them like a mini um, Venti Burst or a mini Sucrose E, okay? Yeah! This dude knows what he's doing. This dude, I, I, I like that dude. Sink knows how to optimize. Okay, and that was it for now, guys, because strangely, out of the 10 winners, only one, two, three, four, five actually responded. And I think tomorrow I will just pull, yeah, five new ones. There are two slots open for the Welkin Moon Pass and three slots open, yeah, three slots open for Welkin plus Battle Pass. So I'm pretty excited uh, who the winners will be and yeah, if they are responding for a change. Oh my god, guys, it's a new day and apparently wonders can still happen. Cool and Uvokun replied to my messages and so they both still get their rewards. We start with the account of Cool. Or as he calls himself in game, Memo. Welcome Moon active. Let's look at those characters real quick. Yeah. Give this account its deserved primal gems. I've never seen that on Baal. I mean, it's 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 viable. Skyward spine as weapon, just like on my account. You <laughs> You have two Skyward Spines! What the fuck? And yeah, ah, it's clear why you didn't refine it. You... You re... You had th three of them on one account! You're either very lucky or massively unlucky. Okay, <laughs> dude. Everybody say hello to the account of Uvakun, who also managed to reply in time to get his rewards. His just rewards because he won the giveaway. In-game, Nekomon, Adventure Rank 56. Let me give you your deluxe package, which includes Welkin Moon and the Battle Pass. Here you go, my dude! Let's take a look at your Venti. Okay, almost level 90, that's good. Uh, rust? Why do you have Rust on Venti? Are you using him to auto-attack? Are you using him to... I mean, you have the Ode. Just equip Windbloom Ode. 
until you find better weapons or Favonius Warbow works as well. Yeah, dude, just equip um, Diona with Sacrificial Bow. It's much better. And give this one to Venti. Or is he auto attacking? No, you don't even. You didn't even level up your auto attack talent. That's that's strange. Are you using physical damage? Sir? My brain can't compute this. <laughs> you have made and beloved on Venti. Why are the are the substats so good? Is this no? You play Venti with a physical damage attacking weapon while not leveling up his talents and he wears a Maiden Beloved set. I don't know where you want to go with that, but you should farm for a very decent Venera set, dude. Mm hmm. Okay, guys, we are once again on YouTube random comment picker to redraw three winners we are drawing for one prize for just the welkin moon and we are drawing two winners for welkin moon plus battle pass so let's see who will get the welkin moon this time and i hope for you that you reply on my comments please do it this is dragging on for far too long congratulations to and now, who will win the two redraws for Welkin Moon plus Battle Pass? Let's go! Be some long-lasting subscriber. Yado! Congratulations, Yado! And the second winner is... Please be a long-term subscriber. Hey, congratulations, Esoteric! I remember that name. And correct me if I'm wrong, but I think that you are really one longer term subscriber so i'm especially happy for you and i hope that you respond my dude okay guys i'm on yado's account right now okay not exactly his account but his mihoyo profile because he doesn't want me to log into his account but he's a very loyal and special friend to have i tell you that guys because he asked me if it's possible to change the walking moon plus battle pass into three battle passes so I can gift him and two of his friends one Welkin Moon each. And isn't that an amazing yeah, gesture of friendship? I'm totally speechless. You're an amazing friend, Yado, and I will unlock the Welkin Moon Pass for you and your friends. And here we go to the next one. Guys, this is Tsu's account in-game. Hey, he's also called to adventure rank 53 am i pulling only veteran players now oh my god he is rocking uh elemental dps team with hu Tao as main and i think this team has everything it needs as you know by now i'm no fan of the hydro resonance so maybe we can find or Sue can find some other healer with the Welkin Moon Pass that I will unlock, unlock for him now. And here we go. Maybe I'm wrong, but I think that every account I've reviewed right now from my giveaway winners had, if they had Hu Tao, they had Staff of Homa as well. Amazing. Okay, that's a little bit unfortunate. No role in crit damage. Poof. But the other pieces... Okay, now I get why your attack stat is so low. Uh. Ah! Holy shit. But still, although your substats are kind of subpar, still very good outcome. And now I'm curious what you did with Kokomi. What did you do? Which artifact do you... Tenacity! Thank you! The best way of building her. Oh my god, I was so nervous to see like this huge clam set on her now. Good, good job. Very good job building tenacity on her. Okay guys, it has been three days and Esoteric didn't respond as well. I will handle the last winner now off camera because otherwise I think that this video will never get released because it already took too long uh, than uh, it took longer than I expected. 
Le uh, to be honest. So I will just end it here. I hope you were entertained and of course I hope that we see each other in my other videos as well. Bye.